Hey, my legion. How y'all doing today? And welcome to Wet Wednesdays. Today I'm here with another craft soda I got from Cracker Barrel. And the one thing, um, they used to have a thing, you get a, a thing of four of them. And, they're, and they were discount, or you get a thing of eight, they were discount, or something like that. And they had like a little, like a cardboard sleeve. You put it in there, and they, hopefully, and yeah, make sure to keep the ball and bottom balanced until it fall out, maybe, the glass bottles. But since then, they have this really nice collectible thing right here, baggy, Cracker Barrel right here, Old Country Store, with a little cardboard divider in here, kind of chintzy, so you can put four pops in, cut of glass, you know, and uh, the prices individually for the bottles are cheaper than uh, Rocket Fizz. This was right here, what I'm going to be reviewing is, with a dollar... 49 this is one of the stranger things swamp pop i have two things for swamp pop they're both bizarre well they're both unusual premium sugarcane soda swamp pop praline cream soda i remember they had like the guy on uh on uh storage wars he had a berry he had a friend that was in the praline but i never had praline and let's, of course, let's show the bottle cap for all you <laughs> bottle cap fans out there. Right, hi, cat. I mean, that's what it looks like right there. If I take it off, I'll even show it better. It says, was made with pure Louisiana cane as opposed to pure Louisiana Undertaker sugar. GMO-free, caffeine-free. says, Burrell's, now Bell's, what's that, Bell's? Pralines, Bell's, Pralines went the uh, refrain of the Prainly Renaissance in the early 19th century French Court of New Orleans as they steadily uh, tan their delicate candies with palmetto leaves to protect them from sitting uh, the stifling Louisiana heat. So maybe uh, Seth Fulbos tried this stuff before for some reason. But she's in uh, the New Orleans. I don't know. If, I, hopefully, I, I think she did okay after that horrible hurricane, though. She said she did. So, I mean, she had to, did do videos afterwards. So, that's good. Uh, let's see. From the single heat, Swamp Pop Praline Cream Soda combines the warm brown sugar, toasty butter, and pecan flavors of this Creole confection with a traditional cream soda. Cause I never had a praline candy before or anything like that. Cream soda recipe to create a whole new... Delicious way to beat the Louisiana heat. No palmetto leaves required. That may not have you shouting Bay Bailey's Praline Cream Soda. I don't know. I'm, I assume I'm not pronouncing that right. And this is not from Orca. This is bottled by, bottled by Swamp Pump. Swamp Pop, not Swamp Pump. Swamp Pop. Let's say it. Louisiana. It says L.A. right there. Now, a joke of mine. I remember uh, a long time ago, a movie came out called Roadie with Meat Loaf. And I always wanted to see it. It was early in 79 or 80 or 81. It had a bunch of singers. It had Linda Ronstadt. It had Alice Cooper. And it had a whole bunch of people in it. And I finally saw it in, uh, I got it at uh, uh, a thrift store. In uh, Fort Bragg, uh, North Carolina, in 90, 90, 90 or 91. And there was a part where the, uh, the, he was hanging on this girl. He's a roadie for these band. Hang on this girl. And then, uh, who's like a groupie or something like that. And he says, uh, we're going to L.A. And, and Milo says, we're going to Louisiana? So I thought that was funny. I think, well, I think Milo was just a rogue. And then he became uh and then he became a roadie as he went there. I can't remember. It's been a while since I've seen it. So it's a very unusual film, but I liked it. So let's go and try it out. Open it up. Is that twist? Oh, it is. Cool. Oh, the smells are very creamy. And then, like I said, here's another shot of the bottle cap with the big S. Sugar cane soda. Creamy sugar cane soda swamp pop right there. Okay. Try to see what it is. That is creamy. I 
I mean, very much so. And strong. You definitely taste the toasty butter, like a buttercream. It's really different. A lot of eight, 180 calories, 46 grams of carbs, 46 grams of sugar. So, not healthy to drink, but I'm gonna. But I mean, it is good. I mean, it's not some. I'm not big into the creamier type sodas like this. If you like a super creamy, buttery, toasty soda. You'll love this. Uh, I like it. I give it a mild 7 out of 10. I got another unusual thing from them, and then I got, I'm going to revisit Moxie. I mean, it's all right, but it's just not, just not something I would usually drink. I mean, as far as like, I like a creamy soda, I go for like a root beer or a white birch beer. But this is a little bit too much. But it does taste good. It's just something I want to get again. But it's just, I mean, 46 grams of sugar, though. Her bottle, that's why I drink diet. But I do give a mom seven out of ten. I wonder if Steph Opal likes this. If she sees it. Um the pray swamp pop praline cream soda. I'm gonna next time I see her in the live stream I'm gonna ask her about swamp pop. So And also uh big red Corey Dempsey too, my buddy. He's in the area too. I gotta send him a shot. I haven't talked to him in a while. Well, I talked to him on the live stream. Him and uh Steph Popel knew each other. Along with, because Steph Popel was married to Phil Anselmo from Pantera. And they and he knows each other. He was in like the metal scene in there, which is really cool. I, I I talked to him some on the live stream, but we haven't talked talk. I talked to him on the phone before, but it's been a while. And I helped him, he put out a video saying he needed maybe some help with uh at the one Hurricane Katrina. I did a video for him for that too. Um so uh yeah, this is pretty good, but I mean, it's just maybe a little bit too much sugar for me. It's not something I would normally drink, but it is very good. So I give it a mild 7 out of 10. I mean, it's just, when I say mild 7 out of 10, it's good, but it's just not something I would normally drink. But it is, all right. If you like a heavy, like I said, heavy, buttery, creamy soda, that's your deal right there. You'll love it. Until next time, bye, please. Take care of my lead. See what happened? I just get to talk and I repeat myself. Eight minute video, but that's all right. All right, take care, everybody.